from the drop down combo box select the option you like for example light travel in a straight line the simulation will automatically display with the best display and the hints allowing the students to move around with the correct display of the source one of the light turn on and then there's an object over here what do you think will happen when you click play notice that the simulation shows the dotted line of the straight line path of the edge of the light to depict this phenomena reset the simulation and you can now explore the other kinds of options clicking play will allow the phenomena to play in an animated way that allows the students to understand visually what is happening so in this case the source light shines a cone of light directed at an object of which there is a shadow cast in the absence of light you can listen you can also use the sensor on the screen to detect the intensity of the light so as the intensity as the distance of the screen gets closer to the light source notice the intensity of the light detected by the sensor increases as well so once it is inside the shadow notice that the intensity is now zero moving on to the next phenomena decreasing distance of a source what do you think will happen after i click play notice that the shadow actually increases in size what about increasing the object size what do you think will happen when i click play again you can see that the shadow increases as the object size increase what do you think will happen when you increase the screen distance from the object similarly you can notice that the shadow is enlarged cast on the screen now for this second final scenario i have used two light sources to depict a slightly different position from each other so that it shows a distinct edge so this is to show that when the distinct edges becomes larger when it is near the object source when the light source is near the object so when it is near the distinct edges is further apart so if it is nearer if you drag it further back you will notice that the distinct edges is lesser now what's wrong with this interactive to notice the difference is you need to drag this particular part and notice that this part is now turned white so this is not possible so this is the part that the phenomena is depicted wrongly